Marriage implies a union that is forever, a relationship that's bound by the establishment of respect, trust, admiration and love. It's been said that marriage is a wonderful institution. However, I like to think of a marriage like a casserole. Only those responsible for it really know what goes into it. So, so, Adam, Liv, I urge you, every day that you wake up, make a promise to yourselves that you'll be the very best spouse you can be. And ensure you say those three little words of I love you every day. I'd like to thank you all for joining the celebration today of Liv and Adam's wedding. Liz and I were extremely grateful and thankful today to Tessa, Peter and Liv for all what you've done in organising today. As we got to know Liv, I could see why Adam fell in love. They seem to fit so well together. They seem so happy together. Liz and I and Hayley were overjoyed that we can now call you live our daughter-in-law and sister-in-law. As I stand here today and introduce you into the fun, the love, the madness of the Goff family, I can assure you that we will love and support you as we do, Adam. Adam has, has given Liz, myself and Hayley so much love and happiness. Oh yeah, and great food. <laughs> Thanks, Liv. And I'm sure that he'll continue to do the same for you, Liv. You're both exceptional, precious gifts in all our lives. And we're proud of what you've achieved and who you are. Marriage is an enjoyable sharing adventure that's full of surprises, twists and turns. As someone that's been married for a long time now, I can honestly say that I'm still on this journey and I never get tired being married. I hope that you and Liv travel on the same journey, love one another, respect one another and remember to try and put each other first. This is only the beginning of your great journey. So embrace it, remember it, enjoy every moment. You're surrounded here today by people who are happy and thankful to be part of your special day. Thank you to you both. We hope we've helped make your day special. And we hope that your shared life together gives you all that you both wish for. I call upon these persons here present. I call upon these persons here present. To witness that I, Olivia Pascal Cook. To witness that I, Olivia Pascal Cook. Do take thee, Adam James Goff. Do take you, I don't know what thee. Do Adam. take thee. <laughs> <laughs> do take thee, Adam James Goff. <laughs> to be my lawful wedded husband. And to be my lawful wedded husband. today and we're both very lucky to have so many special people to share today with. A very heartfelt thanks goes out to you all for making the time and effort to be here. I can honestly say it wouldn't be the same for us without you all here. Although I'm sure for Peter it'd probably be a lot cheaper but that's besides the point. <laughs> I'm in a 
restaurant in St Albans six years ago. Liv started working there part-time to raise some money before travelling around Africa. Her first day, she timidly walked into the kitchen after being introduced by the general manager. I'd like to say it was love at first sight, but I mean, I was very busy and Liv doesn't even remember seeing my face. She literally was like, I don't know who you are, but it's all, it's all good, it's fun, I'm all right. Eventually, a few days later, I said hi, and she seemed like the sweetest girl. So after a few months of chatting, flirting, and coincidentally, oh, I'll give you a lift home. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going that way anyway, it's fine, it's not a problem. Um, I plucked up the courage, courage to ask her if she'd like to go for dinner at Prezzo's. What a treat. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'd love to, yeah, that'd be great. Um, so we go for dinner, and then it's all lovely, and after 10 minutes of eating, Liv sat there with pizza in her eyebrow. Um, yeah, and I knew I liked her straight away. I was like, this girl seems really cool. She's lovely. <laughs> On a serious note, I want everyone to know how lucky I am to be studying right now. Liv, I love you in so many ways and for so many reasons. You know me and understand me in ways I don't think many people can. You make me laugh so hard and smile so often and have a way of bringing the very best out in me. I can honestly say I've married my very best friend and can't wait for what's to come. I love you with everything I have. Thank you for everything you've put in today over the last year. I loved you yesterday. I love you still. I love you tomorrow. I always will. <laughs> Could everybody please, before she realises what she's actually committed to, raise a glass to my outstanding, gorgeous new wife, Olivia. You have both made the declarations prescribed by law and have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of everyone gathered here with you today. It therefore gives me the greatest privilege and indeed honour to announce that you are now husband and wife together. Adam, you may like to kiss your new wife. <laughs>